severed spinal cord, you essentially have broken, broken wires. Um, and so if, if you can just jump over those wires and transmit the singles, signals over those wires, uh, you can give somebody uh, the ability to walk again, naturally. Welcome to Reversing HSP with Shelton. Today I'll be discussing Neuralinks, a brain interface company founded by Elon Musk. A few years ago, I declared on YouTube that I am taking my life back from hereditary spastic paraplegia, and I haven't looked back since. According to research, there is currently no known cure, but finding a cure is non-negotiable for me, and that's why I'm super excited about the possibility of a company like Neuralinks. I believe that if we come together, share information with each other, and motivate each other, we can truly overcome this condition. Once I found out that Elon Musk, the founder of PayPal, Tesla, and SpaceX, also started a neuroscience company aimed at solving specific neurological issues, I had to share what we know so far. Neuralinks recently gave us an update on the company. During this presentation, Elon Musk stated that Neuralink's goal is to solve important brain and spinal problems with a seamlessly implanted device. Musk discussed some of the health-focused capabilities Neuralink's technology could develop. Installation of a chip replacing a small portion of the human skull, for instance, could restore limb function improve human movement, resolve issues with eyesight and hearing. There is also the possibility that the implementation of a Neuralink device into a brain could pave the way for hindering brain issues like paralysis, depression, memory loss, etc. During this presentation, they displayed how the device could read brain activity and influence neurons. The surgical procedure would be performed by an advanced surgical robot to ensure optimal precision. This surgery is expected to take less than an hour, same day without general anesthesia. The device is about the size of a large coin. During the presentation, one of the questions was how long before the device would be available. Elon Musk said that they are preparing for their first human implant soon. They are pending required approvals and further safety testing, but they did receive an FDA breakthrough device designation in July. The head neurosurgeon at Neuralink said their first clinical trial will be aimed at people with paraplegia and tetraplegia, so surgical spinal cord injury. They plan to enroll a small number of patients initially. Elon added that long term he was confident that it would be possible to restore somebody's full body motion. He stated that if you can sense what somebody wants to do with their limbs, you can create a neural shunt, allowing the device to send signals, essentially giving somebody the ability to walk again. In regards to the pricing of the device, Elon Musk believes that the launch price will probably be expensive, but will rapidly drop. He thinks it's possible to get it down to a few thousand dollars. So what does this mean for people with lower limb spasticity and HSP? Well, research shows that spasticity is caused by an imbalance between the central nervous system to the muscles. Well, Elon Musk believes that the Neuralink device will be able to transfer certain signals that aren't being sent to the muscles, allowing people to be able to move and function like they want to. So I'm pretty hopeful for this device. I believe that it could be helpful. These are just my thoughts. Um, like this video. If you want to continue to get updates on Neuralinks, please like the video. Let me know in the comment section. Are you interested in trying Neuralinks? Would you try Neuralinks? I mean, it sounds like some pretty groundbreaking um, stuff to me. So let me know in the comment section. Like always, continue to believe in yourself. Thank you for watching my video. Let's get it. Let's go.